trust me now? You've brought me one step closer to my love. It's a good start. Who is this love you keep mentioning? The most beautiful being in existence. With a face so fair to gaze upon it is to forget all others. Perhaps you've heard of her. Aphrodite. I'm sorry. Afro who? Very funny. The last person who provoked her wrath was turned into a field pig. All right. What's next? Not here. Come find my camp in Yapetos' ruins. Before you go, Persephone has overseers and torches of Hypnos across Elysium. If we're going to weaken her influence, we must destroy them. <sighs> And we're going to need all the help we can get. It's about time I go meet the infamous Persephone. I didn't get a good enough look at you back there. Now I see why my guards had trouble with you. Well, they weren't exactly easy. I'm sure they aren't what mortals like you are used to. You must be someone special. Thank you, uh, your majesty. A simple Persephone will do just fine in my realm. Formalities are for the boring. 
Isn't that what they say? So, Elysium belongs to you? After the rude introduction I gave you, I can't blame you for not knowing. Let me apologize. Ross can attest. Usually, he's the one that does the biting. He would want you to forgive me, too. Tell me your name. Let's begin again. On the right foot, this time. No hard feelings. My name's Cassandra. Then I give you my official welcome, Cassandra. Let me tell you what's customary around here. This place is mine. I know every flower, every face. I alone let them in. But there's something here I don't want. You mean me? No. There's a beast loose in Elysium, and it belongs to Hades. If it gets to him that his wife stole one of his immortal mounts, it'll be a disaster. But I didn't steal it. I won't go near the things. They brought me down here in the first place. No, someone wants me to look back, and I need that horse gone. The Hades? I'll take it you aren't a happy couple. He's tried, of course, to bond with me. But what can he expect out of a prisoner? Love? That's just stuff of legend. You think someone would do this to you? It's highly unlikely the thing got in here on its own. I have to remember Elysium is my paradise, not everyone else's. I'll see if I can find the horse for you. What does it look like? You know it when you see it, trust me. Not only is the beast immortal, but he is terrifying. Horses don't scare me. Has anyone seen him lately? I heard screams coming from the Asphodel Alboritum. Perhaps he's scaring civilians. Bring it to my stable boy, the jockey of Artemision. He'll know how to send it galloping back to the nightmare it came from. That looks like a good place for a horse to take shelter. Get away from Wonder what's wrong with them.
Don't come any closer. You're all scaring my horse. He's just a gentle creature. Have you seen your horse? The others ran away screaming. Leave it to a blind man to see what's right in front of him. Of course I haven't seen it. 
I'm sorry. These are hard times. I'm afraid I won't make them any easier. I have to take that horse from you. You can't! First Persephone takes my sight, and then you take Orphe? Our friendship was instant. I heard the neigh of a fierce horse. I approached him, unafraid. And he licked my palm. Did you say Persephone blind? She had one of her godly soldiers fry me with fire. It was punishment for telling others what I thought of this paradise, and somehow it got back to her. Said I didn't deserve to see the beauty she created. He's not supposed to be in Elysium. Uh Can keep you. A risk I'm willing to take. Oh. Good news, I take it. I know Hades will be missing his beast. I found him, and took him to your stable boy, like you asked. You have no idea the trouble you've saved me. You've earned my favor. Pay that stable boy a visit to cover my tracks. Move.
the wings of her knees. Could this be it? You must be the jockey of Artemision. Nice horses. I keep them clean and pretty, just like Elysium. I tended horses in my old life, too. Then you're just the boy I need to talk to. I have a favor to ask. What favor? If Persephone or any of her people ask, I need you to tell them that I brought a big, scary horse to you. A scary horse? We don't have those here. Then you'll have to pretend. There is Drachmi for you if you do. You're silly. We don't need Drachmi in Elysium. You're sure you're from around here? Of course, I knew that. No matter what, you need to do what I say. Why do you want me to lie? Because if you don't, I'll make sure all of your horses get out of their pens and run away to Tartarus. Understand? Tell them I was here. Fine. Just leave my horses alone. <laughs> he stood there, soaking wet and sputtering, while his boat floated away from him down the Eridan River in pieces. I'd give my sharpest bronze dagger to see that silly human trying to leave Elysium on a felucca. Have you visited my mother recently and given her my love? Always. The meteor sends her love in return. Well, I'd better get back. Elysium won't rule itself. Do keep an eye out for me. I sense trouble brewing in paradise. I was starting to think you'd never get here. You can't waste time if you hope to break Persephone's control over the gate to the underworld. I... You might be playing both sides with Persephone and Adonis, but I know where your true motives lie. Is that so? Unfortunately, no one passes through the gate to the underworld without Persephone's permission, which she has never given. Ever. Luckily for you, as the goddess of crossroads and keys, locked doors happen to be my specialty. Are you saying you can get me through the gate? I'm saying I can help you bypass Persephone. From what I just saw, you're pretty close with Persephone. Why would you want to work against her? I'm not asking for your blind trust. Let me prove our goals align. This unlocks the door to Persephone's hidden sanctuary. She keeps all of her most intimate possessions there, stowed away from her. Husband, among her treasures is a journal rumored to contain information you desperately need about the gate. Bring it to me as soon as you can. Come to think of it, I've seen the door you speak of before. And now you'll be able to open it. I'll go get the journal. The sooner you bring me it, the closer you are to leaving Elysium. Don't waste any time.
Let's go. Let's move. Won't budge. See if it works. Then find that journal. Journal is missing pages. Hope Agati still wants it.
not sure how stealing Persephone's journal will help me open the gate to the underworld, but here it is. Stealing Persephone's journal wouldn't help us, but stealing the journal that belonged to the gate's locksmith will. Who's the locksmith? It doesn't say. Looks like a lot of pages were torn out. Now be quiet while I read. Well, that was illuminating. So? What does it say? Oh, so eager. The location of the gate is not revealed. But so long as Persephone controls Elysium, you need her permission to pass through it. Which you will never get. But if she loses control of Elysium... She loses control of the gate. You need to undermine her influence any way you can. And how do you suggest I do that? Your alliance with Adonis is a good start. His head-on tactics are a little obvious for my taste, but in time, he will wear down Persephone's forces. What about our alliance? Where do you come in? I know all of Persephone's weaknesses, and I'll direct you to them when the time is right. Until then, you'd be wise to spend some time with Persephone's lapdog, Ernis. Learn to use that staff. You'll need a divine weapon in the land of gods. Better stay hidden. Keeper, you found my workshop after all. I know it may not look like much, but it's home. I told you. You can call me Cassandra. In front of the staff? Ha! But I'm glad you came. There's much to show you in this great land. If you're offering, I could use some help getting my bearings. Oh, give yourself time. The golden fields reveal themselves slowly and selectively. But I can help. Walk with me. Maybe you're right. I need to clear my head. Where to? I consider myself a keymaker. One of my keys might interest you. What do you do in your workshop? Invent! All of reality's secrets are hidden behind doors. My inventions act as keys that Let's unlock go. those doors. You... reveal the secrets behind them? Ah! You're as wise as Pythagoras! But why discuss what we can see for ourselves? Observe, way up there, Persephone's first key. If only you could have seen it when it was new! It seems like most of Elysium is in ruins. What happened? This place is beautiful, 
as are all of Persephone's creations. But it is a world that changes at her whims. When I see Decay, I know she needs us at her side more than ever. Imagine all the heroes who have passed through those golden fields, basking in the glory of eternal peace. Each thinking they'd see nothing more beautiful, only then to set eyes on Persephone. Look there, Keeper. That encampment is the site where Iphastos built a home for Aphrodite. Doesn't look like much now. It stood tall until Aphrodite met that child Agonis. His ability to wreak havoc with a wink and a smile is second to none. Come on. Leads to a key I built for the staff. What happened to me in there? Imagine for a moment. Inside you, inside all of us, are parchments twisting like ribbon. On those parchments is written the story of who you are, who you were, and who you will become. Does that make sense? So this. The twisting ribbon defines each of us. And what happened in there changed what defines me. You understand? With these keys, you can unlock the secrets inside you and wrest control from them. I've built many. Thank you. I'm not used to doing this on my own. On the Adrestia, I had Varnavas as a guide. Ah, well, I hope it's a long time before I meet him here. I'll leave you to your adventuring. You're welcome to come back to my workshop anytime. Here, Hermes.
Welcome to the uprising. These ruins were abandoned when Persephone constructed her paradise. We won't be bothered here. But there are so few of you. Most of Persephone's army consists of mind-controlled humans. Free their minds and bring them to me. We can use them as troops. Free their minds? My dear friend Hermes is a master manipulator. And that staff of yours looks like one of his creations. Try using that. There's an outpost southwest from here, nestled in the hand of Hades. Warriors were spotted in its paw. Let's go. You're released from the grasp of Ibnos. Elysium awaits you. Persephone no longer controls you! Hmm. 
You surprise me. When we first met, I was positive you were sent by Persephone to... To what? Seduce me. Confuse me. Anything to make me forget my love. But when I asked you to weaken Persephone's influence, you did. I asked you to bring me warriors, and here they are. You think I'd be the one sent to make you forget your love? You're brave. Beautiful. And if I had to guess, I'd say you had the blood of the gods coursing through those veins. You're kind. But I could... You don't have to. You fight with a passion that could only come from one place. Mortality. <clears throat> Time to find more warriors. Scout spotted one nearby. Was a Spartan hero in his former life. He's not under Persephone's influence, but keeps mostly to himself. With a champion like him on our side, we can't fail. How will I know when I find him? From what I'm told, you can't miss him. Come on. Off we go now. Leonidas! You have the eyes of my daughter. So something did survive that day. How do you have this? Mirimi. She's my mate. I'm here because I need your help. I need you to fight. I have found peace here. Why would I fight? All my life, I was told of my grandfather. 
the king who spat in the face of the gods and ran his spear through anyone who threatened the freedom of his people. Now I'm the one fighting for freedom, and I'm asking my grandfather for help. We'll need to use the terrain to our advantage. So you'll fight with us? Not until you fight me. You say you're Marini's daughter. I want to see how she trained you. You fight well. Warriors will only fight for you if you are willing to. I could have used you at Thermopylae. You could have used a lot of people at Thermopylae. I am glad this spear is in your hands. I will fight with you. You have my word as a Spartan. Thank you, Grandfather. <laughs> 